Good morning, YouTubers. It's Saturday morning, and Hot Wheel Collectors. I'm going to go over some of the Hot Wheels I've got over the past day. Um, I'm going to start off with, even though it's not Hot Wheels, some Christmas tree ornaments I got for five bucks last, for next year. I got Maximum Destruction and the Grave Digger. Um, I actually picked up another Flintstone Mobile. It makes my third one. I'm actually for my buddy. Um, I opened one for my daughter. It's a metal body and top pops off. And the second one I bought, I don't know if you can see it. Let me try to. Zoom in on it a little bit. But it looks like the paint ran from the top left hand corner down to the right hand corner on that one. Let me zoom back out. I bought the 55 panel Atari van. The real rider tires on it. Looks like there's supposed to be something that slides in there. If anybody could let me know, that would be greatly appreciated. And then I was playing with my mega jump track that I got my daughter for Christmas and we we're playing with the um, Team Hot Wheels Hyperline and I realized that there's a little hook on the bottom of it <coughs> that allows the top to pop off. I did not know that when I bought that. It's pretty, pretty neat. Oh, some of my tow trucks here. Oh, my daughter Lillian wanted me to show you guys this 55 Ford, the purple with the green flames on it. She loves purple, so I figured out to get that in the video for her. Um, I got the Acura NSX. It says, it looks like that's out of the D case. Alright, we're going to get on to some of the finds that I got from this local store called V-Stock. Looks like I got, got the Baby Boomer. 99 first edition. Got two motors on it. Pretty cool. Got the fished and chipped. Really like that. Nice body lines to it. Oops, showing my thumb, I'm sorry. Nice body lines. Really like that. Got the 2000 First Editions Diora 2. It's an interesting looking piece. There's the back of it. And then I got the old number three. That was some of the older Hot Wheels I got. Now let's move on to the ones I found at Target yesterday morning before I went to work. A Hot Wheel collector, I was talking to another local collector and he said a couple of these. I can't remember which ones were first editions. I got an aerodynamic. Got the fast gassing. Like the colors on that one. <clears throat> Got the repo duty. It'll be an interesting tow truck in real life. Got the Mooney's uh, 70 Chevelle wagon, and actually, I'm gonna go ahead and crack this one open and compare it to my Mooney's Crate 8. Looks like they, here's the bottoms of them. This is the Crate 8, that's the Chevelle. Let's flip it over. 
Got the eyes on the roof of this one. Flames on the side, moonies. And send. Let's put that back. The Chevelle wagon's got like the different spoke wheels, no flames, no hot eyes on the hood. Looks pretty good. I actually got the blue Chevelle wagon somewhere around here. Alright. Got another Team Hot Wheels car, the Pro Stock car. Looks like a Camaro. Yep. Duh, it says it right there. Didn't even see that. Just was looking at the picture. Then at Walmart, I got me a Dumpin' A, the Flying Customs. Then on to my favorite find. I finally found them. Finally did. So excited I found these two vehicles right here. Minus the fact I haven't found no treasure hunts yet this year but hey not really worried about treasure hunts if I come across them I come across them Bow! I got me the 1966 Batmobile finally I had bought it about two years ago when it came out um, with the back to future car and Ghostbuster car and when I moved out of my mom's house I don't know where the where they went so I'm, I'm excited I actually got this and if it's on this one, you can't really see it, but there is, actually, yeah, that gray part right there on the hood, it looks like it's a chip piece of paint that's been chipped, as you can see on here, it's not on there. We'll go ahead and, we'll go ahead and open one. About that I'm on the verge of getting sick the gray interior clear glass red paint back there are on the parachutes it's like it's a plastic body but overall I'm excited I have it and then I bought this Batmobile From the DC Universe one. I really got to get a new Gotta get a new memory card. My memory card broke won't work all right here's the two Batmobiles next to each other and it looks like that one is just a little this one's just a little bit longer than the 66 one but yeah <coughs> <coughs> But you guys have a nice Saturday. Enjoy.